All right, we got one bell pepper chopped up rough. We have one shallot chopped up rough. Two cloves of garlic chopped nice and rough. Fresh bell pepper chopped up and veggie stock. We're gonna bring it on over here to our blender in which we already have one bell pepper that we have roasted. Give it a little bit of flavor. I'm gonna add this. And this is gonna be the makings of our red pepper coulis. Yum. A little fresh lemon juice. Oh, and then we're going to blend. Oh, look at the wonderful color on our red pepper coulis. This is gonna be absolutely delicious today with our filet mignots. What better to serve a vegetarian than mushroom, pretending it's a steak, pretending it's lunch. We're gonna accompany it with the red pepper coulis, some grilled asparagus, and cauliflower rice. You heard me right, cauliflower rice. We're making this special because we have a wonderful guest coming on in today, Finola Hughes. That's right, you know her from Blossom, you know her from Charmed, you know her from General Hospital and Staying Alive. Finola's a wonderful actress, director, producer, and a vegetarian. And we've got something so glamorous today that we gotta go all over these credits and get this show started today, folks, because you know the drill by now. Come hungry, get ready to taste a better life because we're gonna dish it out. <laughs> How easy is this? Whatever Fanola wants, Fanola's gonna get. Our very special guest today is Fanola Hughes. That's right, you know her from General Hospital, Staying Alive, Charmed, Blessed, and so many wonderful things. She's an actress, she's a director, she's a mom. And today, she's our lunch guest. We're assembling something wonderful, our fillet mignots, which are marinated portobello mushrooms in all kind of luxurious ingredients. Melissa's Produce, a proud sponsor of Dish It Out, has given us some gorgeous stuff to work with. Our portobello mushroom today has been washed. It has been dried, and we're going to remove the fins inside. Wicked easy. If spats can do it, you can do it too. Use a spoon and go through and pull that out because we don't want the extra moisture to affect the grilling. And also when it comes up on the plate, we don't want it just looking shkavad, if you will. No, that's not what Fanola wants. So now assembling the marinade, we're going to get our uh, dry, fresh ingredients together. We have a tablespoon of kosher salt. We have half a tablespoon fresh ground pepper. We have half a teaspoon of liquid smoke. Very strong, you don't wanna use a lot of it. We have one small shallot. We have a tablespoon of chervil. We have a tablespoon of parsley. These are dried parsley. Tip to the gnome, if your spices have been in the cabinet for longer than a year, they're muerte. Get rid of them. That's not what Fanola wants. And then we also have uh, three quarters of a cup of balsamic and a quarter cup of molasses, and two tablespoons of rosemary. Into the blender we go. Stack them, don't smack them. Oh, this is gonna be so good. The portobellas will marinate overnight for our purposes for our show today. We've already done that for you. Aren't you glad you came? I'm glad you came. The molasses is the best part of it. Yeah, let's, let's just give that a little. Maybe about 10 seconds. And I just a little bit of olive oil. and our fillet mignots are dressed to go on out. Mm. Oh, I believe our guest has arrived. Ladies and gentlemen, Fanola Hughes. Hello. 
<laughs> Welcome to Dish It Out. Thank you. This is a huge honor. Oh, I'm thank so, you so much. excited that we were able to get you here. Oh, thank you. Of course, a very, very busy woman, a producer, a director, an actress, a mom. A mom. Oh, yes, big time. Yes. Does everybody eat everything at home? No, not everybody eats everything. Okay. No, we have to sort of, um, I, I sometimes feel like I'm a, a kind of short order cook. Oh. <laughs> yeah. But I, I am a good cook, ish. Uh -huh. And um, I like to cook, and we all do at home. Yeah. So. And you love vegetables. I and do. You're pescatarian. Yes, I am, exactly. That's wonderful stuff. Mm -hmm. Well, Melissa's Produce has been nice enough to give us some great ingredients okay, today good. that we're going to assemble good. our fillet mignots. Okay, yes. With red pepper coulis. I already got Fantastic. a jump on the coulis. Okay, good. Um, I got the portobellos mar marinating for us. They marinate overnight, but we have um, our elves to carry the uh, okay, good. The, the They're marinade speeding bowl. it up. Exactly. I love that. So you and I are going to make our cauliflower rice, and we can get the ingredients okay. together now in a segment we call Pantry, Pantry Raid. Raid. You're going to need cauliflower, parsley, shallots, scallions, Toasted almonds and garlic. All right, so this is what we have. That Absolutely, was that raid. was the pantry raid. Yes. Yes, it was marvelous. It's well amazing. done. Gosh. Okay, right. so we have our toasted almonds, we have our garlic, our shallots, our parsley, our scallions. We're gonna get our cauliflower for the cauliflower rice together. And what we're gonna do is just break it up a little bit. Yeah. You gotta work in batches. Okay. Because um, you don't wanna overload and our. <laughs> Our food processor is Apparently a little special. Not. Yes. Yeah. I have an implement here. That exactly. Will make this thing work. That's the. I'm super excited. The toggler slash diddler, <laughs> and I'm gonna just put a little bit in here. When you're doing the cauliflower rice, you don't want to um, uh, pulse it for too terribly long because it'll you want... mush up. Exactly. Right? Yeah. You want My God. Dry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So okay. okay ready? ready? Zoom. Assume the position. And la la la. We can help these good people <laughs> get a new food processor next season. There we go. What do we think? I think it's fantastic. Yeah, it's a great idea. Because right. I can't always be here with this. <laughs> I have other things to do in my She's life. Like, but with that wand, you definitely are fairy godmother. Yes. Gosh, All right. Okay, so that's good. I like that. Yeah. That's really cool. All right. Now next bit. Next bit. So now you put the... Oh, there we go. I feel like just chewing it. <laughs> it's uh, a beautiful color, isn't it? It is actually, yes. I love uh, being able to get yellow cauliflower, purple cauliflower. It's so pretty and uh, you can find them in the stores. I love it. Well, and that's the best place to buy them. And you do whole roasted, you were saying. I do, like I do. like to slice it up. Mm -hmm. I've lost my touch. Now. There you go. How, okay, here's my question. Tell me, tell me. How did you actually discover that the thing like this works? <laughs> I just want to know the process. There, there's a chef, her name is Cordelia and she does some lovely events and she has a similar apparatus nuts, and I said nuts. oh well this must be culinary approved I guess so. Oh, it's like yeah you have to wash them of okay. course yes so so uh, okay so now we have our collie base all right and we're gonna chop up some scallions okay oh no that's not a scallion this is a scallion yes okay some people is... call them spring onions we've had oh okay. well other... wait this is a scallion and this is a spring onion I call this a spring onion oh I'm sorry yeah but the, the scallion is a spring onion and that's a shallot. Oh, that's a shallot. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Yes. I remember now. I remember it well. Oh, so scallions. Okay, good. Okay. I'm done. Now, do you take the outside bit off? Yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. Um, your okay, first shallot, major scallion. Your first yeah, major gig was uh, cats. Oh, well, that, yes, it was. Yes, I was probably very young. Um, I hope I'm gonna, I'm gonna say I was, and um. <laughs> Yeah, and uh, I I was uh, work, I was a dancer on television, and um, I heard about this audition, so I went down to this audition and met Andrew Lloyd Webber. And, um, yeah, he's going to do our show next season, I hear. Oh, is he? That's yeah. so great, because I'm sure he's a great <laughs> chef. And That's crazy. We had, of course, nobody knew that it was going to be the, the kind of phenomena that it ended up yes. being. Though I kind of suspected. Did you? Yeah, I did. I thought it was really great. You studied at... Um, college in, in the UK for, yes. to, be, to be a ballerina, right? Yes, but I didn't actually, I, I mean, I left when I was 18 because I was already working. So awesome. I went into a ballet company and I'm crying now. This is so sad. <laughs> I went into a ballet company and it was really great. <laughs> and I loved it. And that led you to New York and John and Travolta? That led and me, yeah. 
for they, the they, Yes, it was actually I was actually doing another Andrew Lloyd Webber um, musical uh-huh. called Song and Dance, and so um, I came over and mm-hmm. auditioned, and um, it was amazing. And, and, and then you put it right in there. Should I put it right in here? Yeah. Okay. And then Staying Alive was just like the greatest. It right. was Great fun. And John was so lovely. Uh, it, yeah, it is. It's with you, the onions this and the garlic. Like, I'm sorry. This is what we. This is how we work on a soap opera. With, is it? I always thought so. Yeah, we have onions under the table. Clearly, oh my goodness. Mm-hmm. So this is all of the beautiful stuff that we're doing. That can be, a, that's awesome. Nice rough chop on that. I'm, I'm actually, I was, was taught to roll it and, and then chop it. Okay, yeah. But I hadn't, didn't do it then. That's, yeah, we don't need it we that, need it. we don't need it that pretty and finite tonight. Okay, great. No. All right, so we're going to a little rustic charm. Okay, good. That's beautiful. Okay, so here we are. So we're going to basket that up. We're going to basket Bring this these. up. Yep. You got the nuts. Yes. I'm right next to you. You got the okay. shallots and the garlic and the quali. Yep. And the cauliflower. And here we go. All right. Well, let's cook. Let's cook. All right. Okay. So good. Here we go. So this so, is lovely. What is this like? Is that it? is our veggie stock. Oh, veggie stock. Yep. Um, it's um, uh, mushroom stock that I got at the Asian market. It's fantastic. Amazing. And um, surprisingly, not that much sodium. We like that. Oh, good. I can't stand too much sodium. Oh, good. In okay. Stock. It just it just makes my eyes bulge <laughs> for the next day on camera. It not very, good. No. No. Two tablespoons of olive oil. We have our chopped shallots and our garlic going in. Okay. Woo! Love that. Here you want to? Oh. <laughs> I'm so useful. Oh, that. spoon. Oh, sorry. Oh, oh I got spoon. I got confused. Do you want a spoon? That's okay, look, I'm stirring. It's wonderful. Okay, good. There we go. You're amazing. I Thank you. That's pretty good, right? Right. So, so you just let the shallots get translucent. How long is that? Like five minutes? Not even. Three. It's like three minutes or so. I know, because I don't like to ever, any, any burnt um, shallots or right. garlic is horrible. Yeah, it'll it definitely bitter. leave something up. So I like to very, at a very low heat um, so that the onions get translucent. Mm-hmm. I love that. It's delicious. Low and slow. This looks nice. We're gonna have the cauliflower. Okay. Well, that's great. I put it all in, yeah. yeah. And cauliflower added. Okay, I, I have to stir this because I want the onions and stuff to come on top. Beautiful. Ideal. And this is great. It looks so pretty. And also, so, uh, like, um, it's 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 holding its own yes. in a way. It's not like dissolving into something horrible. Yeah. We add our uh, parsley and scallion that uh, you have chopped into expertly chopped. Expertly chopped. Expertly chopped. Great. We add our two tablespoons of the toasted almonds. Toasted. You put them in the oven to toast them. I toasted them uh, oh, on, on the, the stove top. top. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Great. Yeah. Okay. That's so, looking lovely. Do you want me to that? Yep. Ma- okay. Make it all happy family. Okay. Happy there family. This is really smelling great now. This is yummy. Just okay. to, uh, we don't let the cauliflower go too long because um, uh, we want it to fluff up like, nice, like a, a cauliflower pilaf. Yes, okay. So we're going to add a little bit of the mushroom stock. How much are you adding? I'm adding just about half a cup. Half cup. Okay. And that's gorgeous. And all we oh, got to yeah, do that's now, really good. right? Mushroom stock, yeah. Yeah, awesome. or veggie stock. You could do it non-vegetarian with chicken, but for our purposes today, we're gonna do that. Yeah. And now I'm just gonna cover the rice, and it's gonna fluff. All right. So all right. How, how long did you leave that for? That's gonna set up for ten minutes. It's gonna okay. steam up and fluff up nice. So good. Okay. Right. Portobello's. Gosh, I'm so excited. This is delicious. Okay. okay, so we pull these out a half an hour before we're going to grill. Right. So that they come up to temperature. We uh, made a beautiful marinade. Okay. And we're going to grill them uh, three minutes aside. What? I yeah. love when you put it on the grill and it goes... The sizzle. So good. Here we go. So you marinated the, marinate them overnight? Overnight, yeah. Okay. And you're going to turn them halfway during. You have so. to get up in the middle of the night. And well, you can set your alarm or you can, you can start them when you come home from work. Got it. Awesome. We'll set that to the okay, side. Just the two. Just the two of us. Okay. Do you grill right. at home? Yes, we do. We have one of these exact things that sort of fits across two burners. Oh, I love it. Yep. And um, my 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 kids really like Taco Tuesdays. Oh. So we'll do um, spicy chicken, or we'll do spicy beef. Nice. Or, you know that, and and then I'll make myself something else. You know. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, but now I can make this. Oh yeah, totally. Because now I can do portobello. I've always thought yeah. that this is just such a, a great a great yeah. steak. Yeah, really nice um, grill marks. You're gonna turn your portobello. Oh, make it sort of just yeah, match just your shirt. A, a, a little click there. A little plaid. 
Yeah. So just matching. The exactly. Shirt. All right. These are ready. Three they minutes aside. Now, why do you take the insides out the way you did? Thank you for asking. Just so that the moisture that it, um, the that the um, fins would right. uh, would steam them, as opposed okay. to you getting a good grill on them. Uh, okay, I got you. And you take that. Oh, I'll take this. I'll Sorry. take this. It's not amazing. And I think we'll have lunch. Eat. I'm very All right. About this. We're gonna get this together now. Okay, good. This is the part that I love. I love the, how people plate. Yes. It just looks so pretty. I don't actually serve food like that. But. <laughs> we were excited because since you were gonna join us today, we wanted something to be outstanding. And of course, vegetarians always get the shaft. You know, the broccoli shaft. They oh, get you the. Think so? I think so too. Oh. And here's your lovely pasta with some veggies. Yes, I know. You know, yes. I figured at an awards dinner. So you could... Awards dinner, that's the worst. They give you like these little pockets of, of something gelatinous and you're like, I don't know. I think it's pasta. <laughs> I hope it's pasta. Well, and we yeah. wanted we wanted you to have something nice. Great. This is the red pepper coulis that we made at the top of the episode. And I'm just going to drizzle it. Look <sighs> how pretty that is. See, right? You know how to do it. It's so good. I'll give it a little komasagama. I'll give it a little komasagama. And then we will. <laughs> sure. That's a little Tony speak. Okay, fine. Okay? And then we're going to drop one here. And we're going to give it a little bit of our cauliflower rice. Oh, look at that now. A peel off. Isn't she beautiful? Yes, she's very pretty. Hi, peel off. Hi, peel off. I like to talk to my food. Don't you? Yeah. I Edith peel off, we'll call her. <laughs> <laughs> now that is good. <laughs> Thank I you. I like that. So. Regrets. Okay. Oh, you, oh, you know sing. what? No, no you don't. Oh, Fine, you don't I was just there. realizing that we are... Oh, that's how we, you're doing yeah. it. Yeah, we're missing a little something. I think we need a little something on the side. Dish dude! Oh, we have dish dudes. Oh, you don't know? Oh, they're wonderful. Hey! Oh, how are you guys? Well, hello! Hello there! Hello. Oh, my God. Now, hello. how did you prepare? Come on, boss. Eh? Really? Yeah. Well, grilled. Uh, perfection. They're lovely. With salt, pepper, oil, and sherbet. Yes, oh, there nice. we are. So That's we've got really the flavors good. paired really nice. Good, good. I know it was a vegetarian episode and there wasn't going to be any meat, so... No, but I'm so happy we have some. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy, guys. Thank you, Thank dish you dude. Thank you so much. I wondered why he yeah, was here. <laughs> yeah. See, you didn't have to wait till the nurse's ball for it to fall. No, no. We're just going to take Great. some, just... put it right on the side. Okay, pretty. There All right. Perfect. And then I think it just needs a little wine. Would you oh, pour yes, some I'll wine, my dear? Wine, of course. And we will Very judge nice. it because whatever Finola wants, apparently, Finola gets today. My husband doesn't know that story. <laughs> Russell, weird. when you're watching us, <laughs> yes. and of you course go. you will be watching us, please remember. Oh, that looks so beautiful. Cheers. Cheers. It's a pleasure. Well Thank you done. so much for joining us. Thank you. This is so nice. Cheers, everyone. Mm -hmm. mm. There's a lovely rosé. Mm -hmm. You like? Yes. <clears throat> Mine makes a noise. <laughs> yes. It's, <laughs> it, it's ringing. Hook, line, and clinker. Come on. Very good. Shall Very we? Beautiful. Yes. Oh, that. Dig in. Okay. See, now, this is when vegetarian food can really look amazing. Yeah. We're going for the mushroom mm -hmm. here. We're going to take a little bit of everything. Good. Right? Yeah. A lot of you people don't hard. do that. Like I my, know. my son, my oldest son, he has to separate every single piece of food. Mm. It's very weird to me. We've had I like the whole lot. Absolutely. Mm. 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 Okay. That's amazing. That's okay. I see why you marinated the mushrooms. Mm -hmm. Because you can really taste mm. the little bits of balsamic mm -hmm. and everything. It's very delicious. The molasses gorgeous. gives oh, you good caramelization molasses? and balsamic, mm -hmm. and then the liquid smoke. Yeah, I mean, oh, yeah. I mean, you wouldn't know, but maybe you remember far back a piece of steak, you know? Right, right. But um, it's just the flavor combination that I thought you would enjoy. I love it. It's delicious. Very good. Vanilla Hughes, thank you so much. Thank this you. has been an absolute joy. Oh, thank you. I'm so stoked. Why don't you tell everybody where they can find you? Um, well, you can find me, obviously, on General Hospital every day. And you can also find me at Fanola Hughes for Twitter and Fanola Falona on Insta. That's awesome. Okay. I'm Tony Spatapora. I'm Dish. You can find us at Twitter at Get Dish. You can like us on Facebook at Dish It Out with Tony Spatapora. You can follow us at Instagram. <laughs> oh my gosh, she's got Dish it underscore it underscore out. But the most important thing you need to do is subscribe to the YouTube channel. 
There you go. Dish It Out TV, all one word, so you get to see more wonderful people like Panola Hughes. And delicious food. A salute. Thank a you for salute joining day. us. Slancha. Slancha. How easy is this? This season of Dish It Out was made part by a wonderful... Hold on. Made in, in part. Possible mm -hmm. in part. Possible in part. It's not like Pip. That. Yeah. Okay. This season of Dish It Out was made possible in part to our Indiegogo campaign that some wonderful people turned out to help us support. We'd like to thank, especially... Andrew Ladd in Santa Monica, California. And Julie McMillan in Hawaii. Thank you so Thank very you. much.